Hey guys, I'm FHRC Brony and Golden State Warriors number one fan. And uh, if you guys may recall from my unveiling video, some of you guys thought that was my unboxing video. For the you guys who were talking to me on Skype, you know who you guys are. That was not my unboxing video. This right here is going to be my unboxing video. I don't know why I'm looking that way, but anyways. Um, this is going to be my unboxing video of the Xbox One, Xbox One S. And no, unfortunately, I didn't get myself a Trackless Vortec 2.0, for GT specifically. But, I have money, uh, I still got money currently, but it's still pretty low, so I'm kind of short uh, on cash. But, um, I'm going to save up that money and, uh, make that cash go up. But, uh... We'll see from there, but uh, up till now, I'm gonna unbox this thing. So uh, here we go. Uh, this is actually my first time to ever own an Xbox One, and believe it or not, I've been playing on a 360 for quite a long time. So yeah, I'm kind of old school now, <laughs> technically, uh, as far as you gaming, gaming guys are. Gaming standards, basically. Uh, I'm I'm kind of past my due date. I, I was supposed to get my, an Xbox One or my, on my birthday, but that didn't happen because RCs. But this is my, my friends over there on Xbox Live, um, who the people who moved to the Xbox One, who, and you guys know who, who I'm talking about because you guys were playing Forza Horizon 1 with me for the past few years since 2014. You guys know who I'm talking about, but anyways, um, you guys have been asking for it, so I give it to you guys. So, uh, here we go. Oh, that's upside down. Yeah, that's upside down. Uh, it this way. I unbox an Xbox outside of a box. Or, yeah. Put it that way. Uh, I'll open these up later in a bit. Uh, I'll take a look what's there, what's in here later. But I'm trying to get the main console out of here. Ah, what's this? Uh, actually, uh, give me a second. I actually got to charge these batteries up because these, these batteries are from a 360 and I don't have any extra rechargeable batteries at the moment. I'm poor because <laughs> uh, I spent most of my money on RC car parts. My Rustler is currently running and I need to get my Slack running again. But I'm not going to spend all of my money on getting parts for it. I'm saving up for the Vortec. So, damn, this is friggin' heavy. So, anyways, let's, let's see what we got here. And for those of you who are watching my Forza 5 and my uh, Forza Horizon 3 videos, um, and you guys are wondering, like, how did you get the Xbox One if I just unbox it today? Um, well, that's because my cousin has an Xbox One at his house, so I was actually using his Xbox One because my account's there. So anyways, uh, here's the console itself. Yep. Black bottom and stuff like that. My cousin actually has an Xbox One that's like this one, except his is the Gears of War edition. Uh, yeah. I feel kind of bad touching, kind of feel ashamed of me touching this thing. Hands are kind of dirty, but anyways. Um, put this box aside. And it also has the picture, has, I don't know if you can't see that, but uh, Forza Horizon 3. Yeah. Let me 
open what's in here real quick. Probably a game in here, I don't know. Yeah, what is this? Get free gold on us. For co entry code now for 14. Ah! A little uh, free redeem code for me. Nice. I know Xbox was pretty generous for that. Thank you, Microsoft. A little, uh, little instruction manual. The usual stuff. Every time I'm get myself, get yourself an Xbox or any gaming console. When I actually got my uh, 360 in the first place, and let me show you my 360 real quick. Right, right there, that 360 right there. That was actually the same 360 that I got my birthday um, back in 2011 or 2012. So, yeah. So I had uh, everything that I need in like a owner's manual and stuff like that. They didn't include the game though, so just like this one did. Um, unfortunately. But, uh, I mean, that's what you gotta deal with. I mean, call me spoiled, but I want to get Forza Horizon 3 on this one, but. I mean, I have a game credit. I have Microsoft credits on my on my account, so why not? So let's see here. We got we got uh, this. So this one doesn't have a okay. Um, call me a noob at this one or. Call me a, uh, uh, I don't want to use the language, but call me a dumbass, but, uh, from what I've noticed, this one does not have a power brick. Um, my cousin told me that, uh, or actually my, uh, my, one of my nephews actually told me that, uh, that the Xbox One S doesn't have, have a, a power brick. I've always thought of them having power bricks because, uh, you know, like I said, I'm old school. Because uh, I've been playing a lot of the 360 and the Xbox One that my that my uh, uh, cousin has, he actually has both the One S, which is the Gears of War, and the regular Xbox One, which is like the fat one. He had, that one had a power brick. So yeah, like I said, call me a dumbass, but um, I'm not really up to par with this new stuff yet. <laughs> like I said, old school, and I do remember playing the first gaming console that I ever played was an N64. So yeah, that's how old I'm, old school I am. But anyways, uh, enough talking about that. Here's the, here's the controller. Damn, kind of feel bad putting my grubby hands on this one. Same feeling as the controller that I was playing on my cousin's the Gears of War uh, Xbox One. Um, yeah, yeah, same thing. Yeah, I'll put the batteries there. That's where I'm going to put the rechargeables in. And obviously, yeah. The usual stuff. Okay, that's that's what I'm familiar with. What else? Uh, I guess that's pretty much it. Um, controller, console. I got, I got um, Microsoft credits on my account on my Xbox Live so I can just probably download Forza Horizon 3 there and yeah anything else? Uh, cables, HDMI this main console controller yeah pretty much it just need to add batteries and that's all alright I'm gonna get this thing set up okay we're all set up there's the Xbox One. The 360 is down there. But I got got the cables ready. Um, the HDMI cable is right here. But uh, since I have one for my Xbox, uh, someone just walked inside the door. But anyways, uh, since I don't have an HDMI cable already installed there on the TV, I decided I have to put it there. Let's see what's. Let's see what happens. This is the same setting, uh, same input as on my 360. Mm. Yep, it works, baby. Close the door. It's actually 
on top of my drawer. Where's the find? Because the controls are on this side. So it's gonna take me to set up thing. So I'm prob they're probably gonna ask for the my uh, Xbox Live account. So I'm gonna do that off camera. So here we go. Okay. So it's now in the part of updating. So I gotta wait for a while. Twelve hundred twelve. I don't know if you can see that, but. It says 12, uh, 1,214 megabytes remaining. Yeah, I'm going to be waiting here for a while. It's already like 11 o'clock at night. Well, okay.